everyone, welcome back. I'm Roxanne and today we are going to be doing a get ready with me using the Zovia, Zovia um, Coca Blend um, eyeshadow that I won as well as I'll be picking a winner for my uh, giveaway for the Mother's Day giveaway. You guys have two days to get a hold of me either through my email or through my Instagram. Um, <laughs> so anyway I want to get this going I kind of want to get it done I'm gonna go lay back down on the couch I'm having a really really rough day and this was really really hard for me to do so we are going to get started because yes um, all right. so I'm gonna start I'm gonna show you the shades here so I'm gonna start with this one here Okay, and then I'm probably going to use these two, um, or maybe we'll go with even the darker two here. So this will be like the inside shade, and this, will, sorry, this will be the inside shade, this will be the outer shade, and then I'll add these as my, um, to kind of warm up the back of my eye. Okay, so I'm going to start with the, I think this is Bitter Start. So I have a, a girls' meeting at 9 o'clock tonight. Oh, I'm kind of excited about that. It's one thing when you have anxiety. You need a, a really good support group. People that will understand and they won't judge you. And I'm really, really lucky because I do have that. So I am going to go in with the... Actually, I'm going to... Go in with the Substitute for Love, and I'm just patting it down, and I'm just going to kind of, just follow the shape of your eye, you know, and just leave a little bit on, you know, in between your eyebrow, and the color, this is a really gorgeous shade for just, you know, giving you just a hint of color. For somebody like my skin tone. Um, and then I'm going to go in with this freshly toasted. And I'm going to try to angle it so that it's it's more in the crease than anything else. And just to kind of give it like a layering effect. And I mean, this is going on really, really smooth and it's going where I need it to. Now the color isn't necessarily, you know, like bright, bright brown, which is kind of nice. I don't mind that. So I've got like an angled brush here. Okay, so then I'm going to put on are the e.l.f. Putty Primer. Turned off the uh, dryer, but I did not turn off the washing machine. I think my son is just going nuts with his wash. I think he's back to work this week. Lucas is back to work tomorrow. I am back to work Wednesday. So, um, for the comments today, I kind of want you guys to let me know um, from the boxy pop-up sneak peeks. Um, maybe what you guys would like to see as a prize from there so I'm gonna try to pick up some things for prizes as well as a couple palettes to try out so like leave me a note what you would like to, to kind of win um, is there a skincare you're looking for I am looking for the glam glow uh, the night cream because I have uh, was it down in Toronto or yeah I think it was Toronto and they had a glam glow representative there sweetest 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 young lady and uh she helped me and she let me try a bit and oh, i really really want that i am almost out of my kalela so yeah i get to try some new things so i think i'm going to go on to the sunday riley but i still have some old henderson that i would like to use up before i do that so One thing I don't like about anxiety attacks is that 
there's no reason for them. You're having a really great day. And they hit you. And they make you crumble to your knees. I have been on medication for about three or four years now and it took me a very long time to get onto medication and one of the reasons why I did go on medication was because of the pain in my arm. The medication I am on is working. It's the change in the world. It is really starting to affect me. Going back to work is starting to affect me. Um, Okay, so I'm going to go in with this beautiful purple, dark, dark purple, but oh, I am really liking how smoky it looks. So I'm not putting a whole lot on the brush. I think this is one of my, whoa, I am really liking this look. Okay, so anyway, um. Oh, wow. I'm actually really surprised with this. So it is taking a few coats. Um, so if you have me on Facebook, you'll notice that um, I did mention that I am having a hard day. This is extremely hard for me to say. I have been keeping this bottled up for weeks now. Um, I am doing the very best that I can. This it does help. This it helps a lot. I was trying to avoid doing this today, but I realized I I needed to. So anyway, I'm going to go in with this infusion. It's like a black gold. I don't know if you're going to be able to see the gold. So I'm hoping that it doesn't give it too dark of an eye because I do like how light it is. Oh, my nose is. Oh, I must move my. Must have moved my Kleenexes. All right, let's see how this goes. Sorry for the washing machine. I did not stop the washing machine. And no, I'm not doing the laundry. I'm not doing a lot of things today. I think after this, like I said, I'm just going to go sit down on the couch and I'm going to relax. Alright, so, anyway, um, yes, the, yeah, the pop on sale. So anything you guys want to see me try, you know, test out, review, I will do that. I'm not saying I will necessarily grab everything, but I'll grab some stuff. So I'm not seeing the glitter in this, which is okay. Like, this is like a really nice soft matte, I feel. So I'm going to take another. I'm going to take something like this. And I'm going to use the Subtle Blend. And I'm going to put it in between like I usually do. So I'm wondering if these would turn out better if I had wet, wet my brushes a bit. I'm going to have to remember to get like a little pot of water to dip my brushes in and try that because I've never really tried wet brush. So maybe I'll do that tomorrow. Maybe I'll uh, look into that tonight to see. actually don't mind that at all okay so I'm gonna do under my eyes and I'm gonna do a bit of eyeliner I'm not gonna do a whole lot I'm like I said I do so I have that Mother's Day giveaway I had 16 people enter which isn't a whole lot but it is a lot so you do have a chance to win this um, which is great if you you know kind of want to win it I'm gonna use the poor professional I think there's like one more use out of this so I might as well just use it up oh, no that's a little 
but not the truth. I'm not gonna say that's a lie. I thought that uh, that's all there would be, but there isn't. So I did mine this on the last time. Um, I am gonna use up a sample. I figure I might as well get rid of some of these samples. Now this is a shade that I do actually have like bigger samples of, so I know this is a good shade for me. I actually like this brand. So the interesting thing about this is that it really sits heavy on the skin, I find, but I like it. And I had the big one, but I mean, I just don't need another big one. I did buy the, um, the Yenza and I might, I'm going to have to like break into that. So this is actually, um, Makeup Forever HD. This is a, um, a really good foundation for me. I actually really, really like it. So let's get this on and then we'll do, I have the Pretty Vulgar out because I really like that concealer. Um, it's number two in my books. So when I post stuff like I'm having a really hard day, I don't do it to get sympathy. I get it. I do it because sometimes when you hear somebody else is having a hard time, you can reach out and then you guys can build a bond on that. Sometimes they don't answer right away and it's just because it's so hard for me. I've been dealing with anxiety my whole entire life. I remember when I was just a young kid and I had my first anxiety attack and my dad called me like this drama queen. Cause I had no idea what it was, right? Don't do that. When somebody is suffering from anxiety, you will know a fate from a drama. I just remember I couldn't breathe. I just could not breathe. I was having a full out panic attack. My mom called me down. She knew what was going on. So, since then, I've learned not to go into that hyperventilating. You will see that I will stop in the middle of a sentence and bring myself back. I'm really good at that. But there's only so much you can do. You do need a community. And anybody that tells you that you don't, it's just not worth your time. Everybody deserves to have a community. Okay, so I'm going to go in actually with this really nice, um, what is it called? Um, I'm actually going to go in with this Beans Are White. I really like it. I, I'm going to say I really like this palette, which is kind of strange. I did sell the other two because I just, they did not work for me. This one is actually working for me. I am really, really happy with it. So I had actually won this by doing a makeup look. I think I did a Jeffrey, Jeffrey Star. My phone's kind of going nuts, sorry guys. I really do have an awesome, awesome group. I've got an awesome group of girls that uh, I said, hey, I'm having a hard time, can you help me out? And they said, yeah, and they're excited. Like we usually do like a, a once a month get together because we're moms and moms we neglect ourselves it's mother's day and i'm like i'm not doing that and i know it sounds like oh but i'm not it's because i need this one day and i'm so lucky because lucas is such a, a wonderful person he is an amazing man and he loves his his daughter and his three stepchildren and you know he does really go over and above what some people you know would I also have an amazing mother-in-law who, she's out of this world, she's, you know, this is her first grandchild and she's, you know, went from having no grandchildren to having four, so, I mean, she loves all of them, 
absolutely, you know, is phenomenal and she's made me feel like part of the family and I just adore her. I think she's amazing. Um, my mom is, I don't know if she's made me who I am and I talk with her frequently when I'm having a really bad day like today I would normally phone her so I'm gonna probably give her a call after this and let her know you know I miss her I mean I really wish you'd come back <laughs> uh, I really do and she'd bring my puppies with me with her it's her dog but he's mine these are my puppies. And Sasha is really quiet right now because I took her out to uh, play fetch, so she's probably comatose somewhere. Okay, so um, I'm going to put some of this really light shade up in here. I'm going to give my eyebrows a This is a really nice look. I'm not going to sit here and lie. I really, really like this look. Okay, so. Mm -mm. Do my eyebrows. I know I'm not much of an eyebrow person, but this is. I am going to use this Ico Lash Alert Mascara Make Wake Up and Go. There's the brush, it's kind of super cute. I kind of like that. Okay, so. We'll use the Tarte because I, I love this. I'm not even going to try to make excuses for it. I like the um, Elf one, but it just seems so, it's so pigmented. I really, really like this look. You can tell. So. Use this one. This Afra highlighter. And I think I picked out. Did I pick out? Oh, yes, I did. I don't know if you guys can see that, but. Let me see that. <laughs> okay, so let's see here. I'm going to use my ColourPop lip liner. All you're going to hear is my washing machine. Hey, my son. I think I mentioned that earlier. My son is like doing a whole load of laundry. So I decided to go with something a little more pink. So.
Okay, guys, so there's a final look, and I just about forgot about this one part. Um, So, I have in the video here, I have filled duplicate users, and then I said um, to filter comments based on a specific text or hashtag, so you had to have the Mother's Day giveaway. It has 16 commenters. I don't know if you guys can see that or how well you guys can see that. Okay, so here we are. Okay, guys, good luck. Let's see. Oh, don't you start. Let's see if we can do this again. Okay, so. Mother's Day gives. Oops. Okay, so get YouTube comments. There's minus 16, so, oops. Okay, so right here we're going to go to start picking the random winner, and the winner is... Esther, you won! Ah. This is, you know, I nominate myself with infer infertility journey. Mother's Day isn't easy, and I could use a pick-me-up. Look at that, Esther, you won. Congratulations. Now, Esther has won before on this channel. She has gotten the prize. So, um, Esther, just send me your email. You have me on Facebook, so you can just message me and let me know uh, that you want this. And that, uh, and I will ship it out uh, tomorrow, today. I'm just going to go and sit down and relax for the rest of today. So, um, Esther also runs the... Um, the uh, the giveaway on the um, the group. So if you are Canadian and you do want to join this group, just let me know. Leave me um, a message below. It's like a little raffle group, and it's only open to Canadians. Um, but they also do a lot of neat things, like you post a look and you can win a palette, and they run that all week. And um, I mean, you just pay for the shipping, which is about four or five dollars. It's really not nothing at all. And like I said, I've won. Um, the Jeffree Star bundle that I have and then I've also won the Huda palette palettes and um, I've won this so I mean and I find I'm like the least luckiest person you'll ever ever meet so I think I needed that I needed to give away something it always makes me feel better it's the strangest things it's I don't know Sometimes I think I'm being selfish when I give something away because it does make me feel better. Sus. Sussy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And all the uh, pet mom. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Okay, guys. I know how lucky I am. So this is for all the uh, animal lovers out there. Sassy, 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 sassy. Um, thank you guys for watching. I uh, appreciate it. Um, also, we're almost to 750 subscribers, and I'm going to do another giveaway as well as I am going to go on to the pop-up shmore, pop-up shmore, pop-up store tomorrow. And I'm going to get something to give away. So I want you guys to leave me details. What would you like to see in the next giveaway that might be at the pop-up store? Um, as well as, do you want me to, what palettes do you want me to grab to try out? Um, and possibly, maybe I'll grab two. One for me, one for you. You know, just, uh, yeah, leave me a load of comments. And happy Mother's Day to all. I hope you guys had a great day. I'm not saying I didn't have a great day. I just had a very hard day having a hard day today will get better i know it tomorrow will be better and so on and so forth one day we're not going to talk about wednesday because wednesday is going to be a different day so 
Anyway, this is enough chit chat. I hope you guys are doing okay. Um, thank you guys so much for watching.